Hey guys, let me welcome you back to the channel. You're watching Survival Mindset. Today what we're going to be reviewing and demoing out here is the Tops Knives Bushcrafter Kukri number 7. Yeah, so we're going to be field testing this today in the forest and see how well it handles. It's a pretty good feeling knife overall. Um, look at the scales on it, nice and thick, beefy. Um, it's got an excellent chopping power of a handle. Great feel to the handle. Nice sweep to it as well. So it'll make an excellent chopper. So we're pretty deep in the woods right here. What I'm gonna be doing is removing some of these real quick. And then we'll be chopping this one down. Because it's no good. This one got hit by lightning. So, yeah, I'm kind of on a steep incline too. I'm on a 45 degree slope right here. There it goes, guys. Whoa. Oh, wrong way on that one. Close call. But yes, the Tops Knives Bushcrafter Cookery did one hell of a job. Here's how the thickness looks on the tree. Um, I would say it's about five inches. Yeah, so the tree was burnt. It was struck by lightning. And here's where it started to snap and this is the length of the tree right here so we're looking at somewhere in the neighborhood of about 15 to 18 feet tall on this one 
right here. You guys saw the kookery in action on some wet wood. This is kind of dry wood. Um, it's pretty dry actually. Um, it's rotted too as well. So we're going to do some chopping on this one. It's kind of bouncy. Actually, this piece is so rotted, guys. You can't really get a good test on this piece. As you can see, it's full of bark beetles inside of there. So, a, it was pretty hard through the first inch and a half. And then you got into all this rot. This piece looks a little better. It looks more solid. Um, so we'll be trying it out on this right about right here. So that'll be my mark. Yeah, it's a lot more solid, guys. So wood eater, let me tell you, look at that. Oh yeah, handles like a champ. And I'm also choked back all the way on this one. So I'm getting a lot more power with my blade. So nice chopper, tell you that much. Not bad at all. Let me put the knife down so I can show you guys how well of a job that did. So you guys can see, went down almost two inches there. I would say an inch and a half here, inch and a quarter there. Not bad at all. Overall impressions on the Bushcrafter Kukuri 7. It handled extremely well. Felt really good in the hand. With the curve handle like that, you can get really good chopping power as long as you hit the sweet spot on that belly. You should have no problems, you know. Um, the handle also has a bow drill socket. Um, I recommend using that in the sheath. Um, the sheath has molly webbing attachments on the back. Has a little pocket right here. It has a sleeve of kydex inside of there, so your knife point's not going to be coming through the nylon. Um, it has Velcro straps here, guys, two of them, so it's going to keep your knife secure. Also, it has probably a two-inch belt loop as well. Um, overall, the sheath's nothing fancy or nothing, but it's going to hold the knife. Um, there's not too many times that you are going to use a kukuri unless you're chopping all day long. So today we are chopping all day long and it handled perfectly well. Okay, batoning. Yes, you can baton with this one. I wouldn't recommend it. Um, it's kind of awkward to baton with. But yes, it'll do a log probably under 5 inches with ease, no problem. Um, the jimping on the back is pretty aggressive as you guys can see so if you're doing fine detail work 
like a feather stick, um, a pull motion or a draw motion. Um, you're going to wear your thumb out pretty quick on that one. So that's probably the only problem I have with this. Um, the knife isn't really balanced. It's always going to be leaning down, but that's good because this is a chopper, okay? It's not supposed to be really balanced in the middle here. It's always going to drop down, you know? So you're going to get a good chop, a consistent chop every time. That's all I have to say about the Bushcrafter Kukuri 7 made by Topps Knives. I want to thank you for tuning into the channel. I really appreciate you guys stopping by every week. Hit the subscribe button. It really helps out to make these videos. I appreciate you guys stopping by. That means a lot. You're watching Survival Mindset. Peace out.